Hello, this is Ron from Ron's uh, Apple and iOS channel. I have a uh, unboxing for you today and a demo, uh, so uh, stay tuned. All right, um, I was at the Apple store recently. You get this real nice bag like here. It's like a high-end uh, jewelry store. So let's see what we got in here. Oh, look at this. It's a new Apple uh, watch. I think it's that, uh, that Series 4 watch that... Uh, just came out. Hey, just kidding. Um, this watch came out, I think, in October. So you're probably asking, Ron, why are you unboxing a watch that came out uh, two months ago? Because it, it uh, mostly sold. Well, it, it uh, a lot of people bought it because of the uh, EKG feature uh, that they advertised at the Apple event in September, and it wasn't uh, uh, activated in software until this week. Um, I believe it was uh, you had to have iPhone upgrade 12.11 and uh, iOS watch upgrade 5.12 to get the uh, e ECG. They call it many things. The EGG, um, you know what I mean. So uh, let's go for the quick unboxing here. Now this um, the watch box has these. It's kind of like a tab thing on the side here. So you kind of pull this up, and then you pull that out. So pull up, pull out, so it's uh, like fasteners, but it's all paper. So um, you get this uh, real fancy uh, inside of the box with the uh, different color uh, watches and bands. That's really nice. Let's so put that aside. And inside you get the uh, watch band and the actual watch box. So um, let's open up the band first. Uh, so I have the uh, the white band. Um, you get two different sizes. You get one for a bigger wrist and a smaller wrist. Um, I forget what the measurements are, but um, I need the one for the bigger wrist. So that's the uh, top part and the uh, bottom part. All right, let's put this aside for a minute. Okay, here the, uh, is the main event, the uh, Apple Watch Series 4. Um, this is the 44... Uh, inch uh, size, the bigger one. Uh, nice sturdy box. Uh, you can probably hear that lid hit the table. Um, you get this little thing here. It's some uh, instructions and paraphernalia. We're going to put that right back in because the more you take it out, the harder it is to get back. Alright, so here's the main event. Here's your um, charging brick. Here's your um, lightning uh, USB uh, connector to, uh, well not lightning, but USB connector to the port uh, and to the uh, watch. You get this little fancy thing here where you, you lay the watch down on at night or whenever you need charging. We're going to leave that in there for now. And uh, here's the watch itself in this little like, kind of a velour case here. It even says 44 uh, millimeters on the top. Very secure in there. So we'll Put that back in there for now. We don't need that. So um, here is the watch itself. Uh, it's already on and powered up uh, by the miracle of uh, YouTube. Um, so we're going to install the um, the bands here. So you want to put the shorter piece on the top here. You just uh, slide it in there. Locks in place. And then uh, you put the larger one down here. It uh, locks in place. So uh, there you go, you have your uh, watch. So we'll get it on the wrist here. And uh, let's see here. All right, we got secure on the list, wrist here. Now we'll have to uh, type the uh, password in. So we hit that button here and you punch your four digit passcode in and you have your watch, that's kind of the, the new face, The uh, the, the main phase now, of course, you can change this to any phase you want to change it to. Um, so um, the next thing we want to demo is, um, you know, you, you know, all you people are probably big fans of the Apple Watch. If you're watching this video, so you, you don't need any of the, uh, you know, all the standard stuff. So let's get right to the um, the new um, e e uh, ECG feature. I think they're calling it ECG. Uh, I've seen people call it. EGG, but you know what I'm saying. Uh, I'll put it down in the show notes what the actual um, handle. Well, we're going to actually see here in a second. So, um, 
what you want to do is you want to uh, uh, go to all your apps on your phone. You have to, um, you don't install this app, it's just uh, uh, by the miracle of science that appears on your uh, phone when you um, upgrade to the um, the new version of the Apple Watch. So let me bring it a little bit closer. All right, I'm going to demonstrate how to uh, use the ECG feature um, after you have enabled it um, on your phone. Um, okay, so we're going to um, go to our apps here by pressing the crown again. Uh, we're going to scroll down here to the bottom and get this, uh, hit the red icon with the lines. Uh, right now we're in the... Uh, ECG app, so it's telling me to hold my finger on the crown. You don't have to press it, you just have to hold your finger there for 30 seconds. You want to uh, relax as much as you can, keep your arms on the table, which I'm not doing now, so I may not get a good uh, rating here because I'm trying to hold this um, as steady as possible for the camera. But I um, said so you want to rest for the best result. I've done this two times already and uh, so far um, I've got good ratings. I have no AFib symptoms. So there we go. Uh, it says I got a sinus rhythm. Uh, does not show signs of uh, uh, AFib so uh, I'm good. So then take your, of course, take your finger off when you're done. And uh, you can also check those results in the uh, Apple Health app on the phone. All right. Thank you. All right, one more thing. You have to go to your Apple Watch app and uh, scroll down to the uh, hearts uh, preferences and then change the top setting. I already have it changed here because uh, I had activated, but you change that top one to uh, record the data on your um, health app. So, all right, thanks a lot. See you in the next one. Mm -hmm.